Hello, welcome. In this video, we're trying to determine if this equation is balanced for all values of x, except where this is undefined. So how can we do that? Well, uh, we're either going to look at this in terms of our laws of logarithms, and then maybe try to pick an example to plug in and see if it works. However, in this case, we have log base 2 of 7. And I'm going to infer that, well, if this were true, uh, it would be true for any base of any power. So why choose 2 and 7? Why let, why, let it make, why let it be complicated? Let's use some wishful thinking here. Let's use wishful thinking and make this much nicer to see if it's going to work. So what would that look like? Well, I would do the log base 2 of 8, a power of 2, to the x, let's say, uh, second. Does that equal twice the log of 2, base 2 of 8? Will it? Maybe. I don't know. But these I can work out pretty quickly. Because on the left-hand side, that's just uh, log base 2 of 8 is 3, 2 to the third is 8. And squared, that should equal 2 times the log base 2 of 8, which is 3. And you can see that it doesn't. On this side, this is 9. 3 times 3 is 9. 2 times 3 is 6. So this doesn't seem like a reasonable thing. Uh, it doesn't seem to be true. In this case, let's say x. Let's cut this off now at this. If x equals 3, would this be true? Well, when you have an unfriendly situation, use the calculator. We have the log base 2 of 7 to the third. So that's in parentheses here. We do math. We go to log base. There's the bottom. And we pick uh, base 2 of 7. And that whole thing, we chose x to be 3 here just to test it gets you about 22.12, is the same as 3 times the log base 2 of 7? No, it's not, right? So this is a false statement, and we'll look at what this is close to. This is false. What is the true statement? The true statement would be something like this, the log base 2 of 7 to the x, and that would equal x times the log base 2 of 7. And the difference is that here this, the x only applies to the 7. In our case here, the x is applying to the whole thing, and that doesn't work with this law of logarithms, which is called the clog law, where the log of any base of a to the c equals c times the log base a of a, or the, and there's the word clog. So it only works, and the exponent is tied to essentially this number here, the result, not to the whole logarithm. All right, I hope that helped.